quit using drop pitches and toe balls as recovery points. There are better options out there. Rhino USA makes a hitch shackle that is rated for over 30,000 pounds. I always see a lot of comments where people say, oh, just take the toe hitch out and take the drop hitch out, insert the end of your strap into the hitch receiver and just use your pin. Now that may work sometimes, but again, it's not the best option. What happens if you have a really hard pull, uh, this pin will actually bend inside of your receiver and now you have to cut it out. And it's just a hassle. There's better options out there, guys. Use that hitch shackle, it's not gonna let you down. It's a closed loop system, very safe way to do it. And I'll demonstrate to why this doesn't always work. Let's say you have a big kinetic rope. That kinetic rope is not gonna fit in the end of that receiver. So you, you're not gonna be able to run that with just a hitch pin. If you have a large toe strap that's rated with a high brake strength, they don't always fit easily in, in the receiver hitch. That's why we recommend just, just running a hitch shackle. 